hi guys welcome back to my channel so today we're going to do another shoe review um a lot of the shoes that i've just done are based around shoes that i've got for my birthday they will come back in what i got for my birthday video but they will not be showcasing like a review or anything because i've probably already done it so i'm going to do a review on these because i have worn them now for an, a couple of weeks because i've had these a couple of weeks now guys um it might be a couple of weeks, it might have been three weeks, I'm not too sure. In fact, guys, I might have had these about a month now. I do remember my husband getting them me early and I was just going to put them away, but he said, no, you need to wear them for a while to see how you feel about them. So, guys, without further ado, these are the Demonia Sinister number 61. They have a few different designs in these in the Demonia Sinister shoes. Now, what do I think? So, for me, guys aesthetically they are beautiful and i mean beautiful because i do love these big bulky i love the round toe i absolutely love tuck shoes um i love this whole this design this whole shoe design thing and i actually need to get my tuck shoes rear heel because one of the heels has come off they actually have um i think they have some kind of skull design here but these are the Demonia 61s. They are in like a charcoal grey. And then, as you can see, they do have this buckle design that go all the way up. You can tighten these at the buckle if you needed to, if they're a bit slack on you, if you're a little bit more slender on the calves, on like, uh, like the bottom of your legs. Unlike me, um, they fit me as they are. They do zip from the front all the way down, guys. Now, it's took me a little bit of a a while to try and break these in guys because like uh dot martin boots they do rub at the back of the heel um and i found that these were rubbing me and the reason they rub so bad is because do you know like with with boots you can wear socks i won't wear boots without socks on because i just think that's asking for your heel to be crippled so i always wear socks but <laughs> you can't necessarily wear socks with these because they're quite opened and it, it, it does look a bit silly, guys, I will admit. But I will I will show you what I've been wearing inside just to break them in. Because when I was wearing these just barefoot, they're all right for a while. But when I was walking like to school in them, I find that they started to rub me at the back. And they have rubbed me slightly at the back of the heel. So um, this is what they look like. They've got like a, a steel heel, almost like the new rocks. A lot of people... Um, Maxi Raven actually thought that these were new rocks, bless her, and she was looking for them on the new rock section. And then she was like, oh my God, they're actually demonious. And I was like, yeah, that was that was my um my like look on my face. I mean, my box is upstairs from guys, I didn't want to bring them down because I've been wearing these, so I put them under my bed. If I know I'm not going to wear these very often, I would probably leave them in the box. Like I've got a lot of my demonias are in the bag because I've got some that come in a bag and I've got some that come in boxes. Um, but there's only so many boxes I can put in my wardrobe. Guys, when you do the wardrobe tour, you will see it's a nightmare. So I think my husband's actually put the box of these in the loft until I decide that they need to be put away. I don't want to wear them for a while because I do go through that phase with shoes. Now they have this spike design all the way up the back, which I absolutely love. And then here across the back end of the shoe, it has the demonia. On the buckles, it does actually state Demonia on each buckle. And then they have the D symbol all the way down on this little press stud design that goes down the middle of the zip. The zip is a, a really good strong zip. It zips down quite easily. I just love these shoes, guys. Now, every pair of shoes gets scuffed in the same place. And it really does upset me that I walk this way. But there's not much you can do. I walk with my feet like this. So I tend to rub like this and what's happening is I'm rubbing you can just see the marks here where I've, I've rubbing my back of my heels together I walk like a duck guys and then here again I have scratched them and my husband said how the heck have you done that and I said I don't know just probably the way I'm walking so here's the bottom and they've got a demonia sign right at the bottom as well um they're heavy but they're not that heavy they're heavy enough but they're not that heavy um i'll get the information up from where i got them from so guys this is the socks that i've been wearing with them they're like little ankle socks but they're like tight socks um and they've got a little bow on and i just thought they were really really cute so i have worn these with them i actually keep them in my boots so i don't lose them and i've actually got my um fishnet 
ones that I got from um, Killstar. I have seen a lot more on Killstar that have just come out, so I probably will buy them just for this kind of footwear. So, um, and I've got a red pair of these as well, and I've got a red pair of these, so I've got four pairs of them. So let me just get my glasses on and have a read. So guys, I've not worn them out on a night out yet, and I think I would like to put them to the test on a night out. I've worn them out to school, I've worn them into town, and um, I did find that after a while they were hurting my, my not my back, well, not, not hurting my back because the instep is not that bad. They were hurting the back of my heel. And um, I, I don't, I'm not fond of shoes that hurt me in any way, like my back. So these guys were £92.95p. You can actually pay for interest free payments of 23 24 fortnightly with clear pay. Just saying. And um, you can find these, you can share these on Twitter, Facebook and so forth. I have already shared these when I got them. They're the Demonia Sinister number 61. It says it's a three and a half inch chromed ABS heel, one and a half inch moulded platform shoe. So brand Demonia, heel height is three inches, insole is semi PU, sole PU, they are grey. Um, it doesn't really say much, it just says your new Demonia Sinister 61 will arrive in the Demonia Signature box, which I've got upstairs, and will be discreetly packaged in a plain brown cardboard box. Correct, I've thrown that away now. Um, to ensure to ensure that they arrive to you in perfect condition. Um, it was DPD who delivered them as well. And it also gives you free return service within the mainland of UK. And it just says if you are going to return, keep the original packaging, obviously. I did keep my original, like my box with it until I knew for, for certain I was going to keep them. But as soon as I seen these, even if I, they hurt my feet constantly, I wouldn't have got rid of them. I would have still kept them because I just love them. They've got the demonia inside as well, so you can see it there. Um, I do like my bulky, chunky shoes. It doesn't say anything else about them, guys. It says be the first to write a review, so I will eventually get around to doing that. I've got so many reviews that I need to do, and after my last um, review that I got refused to do, it's put me off a little bit. I ain't going to go into that. So... Um, I've worn these now and I think what I may do is carry on wearing these as many, as many times as I can but I have got lots of shoes that I'm wearing at the minute. I'm I'm in between shoes like I'm wearing the Boohoo boots that I've just got. Um, the last pair I got from Boohoo which um, Jade the Libra, she did a Boohoo haul recently and she bought the same boots and I messaged her and I said Jade, I said we've, we've actually bought the same boots. And she, she messaged me back and she thought, oh my God, yeah, we've got right good taste. And I said, well, you'll see mine if you have a look at my videos. And, um, she, you know, she replied back and I just thought, that's really nice for her to, to reply back to me. You know, some massive YouTubers don't reply back to messages, but she messaged back straight away. So thank you, Jade, for that. Um, so I've been wearing them two on and off. Um, it's weird because my shoes get cast off like like a new coat would do you get a new coat and you wear it all the time but um i'm gonna go and try these on see what you think um i can say that bear with these shoes guys they will hurt for a little while a bit like the dot martin shoes not as bad as dot martins you don't have to wear these for as long to break them in or wear them in water or stretch them i do have shoe stretches as you know but these don't need stretching they just rub slightly because i wear them barefooted if i was to wear these with tights they would be perfect. So guys, these are the Demonia 61. Um, and like I've said, um, they have got like a steel heel and I just love this stud effect. Now, I haven't questioned if we lose a stud, what happens? Um, I have had that situation with shoes before and I've had to buy some on eBay, but these are a, sp a specific round kind of, um, but they are quite solid. There's one here that's gone quite loose, so I'm a bit worried about it. But if you twist it, it will tighten them back up. Some of them do get loose, guys, but if you just twist them, they will tighten up again. Um, but yeah, they've got a one, two, three tightness on the buckle. So if you do want them a lot tighter in the ankle, you can go at the tightest. I'm actually at the tightest, guys, and the same here. 
I just think they're absolutely amazing. So guys, pop your comments on below and tell me what you think of these. Would you like a pair of these? Do you think they're too expensive? Or do you think these are quite reasonable for Demonia? I love Demonia shoes. I love New Rocks. I love Doc Martens. I love Tuck. I love all kinds of shoes that are bulky and quirky. Killstar are hit and miss for me. I have got Killstar shoes. I probably don't love them as much as I do with my Demonia. I think for me... Demonia, Pleaser and New Rocks come before any other shoe. Don't mind, are all right, but I don't like the breaking in part of them. That's about it. All right, guys, take care of yourself. And um, these will pop back again in my what I got for my birthday video, but I will not be talking about them, if that's all right with you. <laughs> all right, guys, take care of yourself. Wait to the end, you'll see the try on. I may try them on with and without the socks so you get to see what they look like in both. And um, pop your comments on below, tell me what you think. Okay, guys, take care of yourself and I'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.